Welcome to the Visio Map Editor tutorial series. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to create a surface and then modify a surface. We're going to start by creating a surface. To create a surface, we choose the Surface tool from within the Draw tab. To determine the shape the surface might have when we add it to the map, there are three types of surfaces that can be created. Rectangle, Circle or Polygon. In this tutorial, we're going to create a simple rectangle surface, so let's select the Rectangle tool. Next, we choose the style. The style determines two things, the extrusion height and the default color of the surface. The extrusion height is the height given to the surface when the map is built. It's this height that provides the 3D effect within the map. Each style has its own predefined extrusion height, it's possible to customize that extrusion height, um, but that's a different topic. For our surface, we're going to use the Building 3 style. The style also comes with a default color. It's possible to override the default color by activating the second color option. Let's do that now and choose the color blue. To create the surface within the map, we simply click and drag on the map where we want the surface to appear. The style's extrusion height determines the drawing order within the map. A surface which has a style with an extrusion height that is higher will be placed above another style. For example, the Building 3 style has an extrusion height above the terrain style, which explains why it's drawn above within the map. If we change the surface's style to be C1, for example, then the surface will be drawn below the surface with the terrain style. This is because the extrusion height of the C1 style is below that of the terrain style. To get our surface back, we need to hide the terrain style. This reveals our surface. We can now select it and change its style back to Building 3. Now if we unhide the terrain style, we see that our surface is drawn above. Now, let's preview the map to see how our building surface appears. Here, we can see our blue building within the map. It has its uh, extrusion given by the style Building 3, and it has our color, which we've defined for this style. And finally, if we decide that we want to return to using the default color, then we simply remove the second color um, by clicking on the, the cross in the, in the color selection. Okay, that's all for surfaces.